Saturday was a day to remember here at Chabasso as kids and adults alike were able to meet one of the pioneers of skateboarding, Steve Cavallaro, but not only that, he showed them a few tricks. Everybody knows who Tony Hawk is, but everybody should know who who Cab is as well. I mean, he's right there with him. Steve Caballero has been skateboarding for 48 years. He invented a few tricks you might know today and was in the Bones Brigade with Tony Hawk. Oh man, I've been watching Steve Caballero skate for over 30 years. Some say he might, might say the best to ever touch a skateboard, but it's going to be exciting. He says it's pretty special that he can still share his love for the sport. Here I am going to be 60 in November and to be able to continue to share that love and passion that I have for the sport with others and inspire people. And so never would I have thought that I would be skateboarding as a, grand, as a grandpa. For Caballero, he loves that Chibasso affords people of all ages the ability to express themselves on a skateboard. And it just teaches people to believe in themselves and to work hard for something and, and to reach goals. But it also teaches them how to fail to succeed. It's not easy to do. You just can't hop on a skateboard and be good. You have to practice and practice. And there's a lot of failures. You know, there's a lot of falling. He wasn't just sharing his love for skateboarding on Saturday, but also his art. It's great to be able to uh, inspire people in the most productive and positive way. And I try that with not just my art of skateboarding, but through music, uh, through art, and also through my lifestyle. And for people of all ages, it was a dream come true to meet a skateboarding legend and to see him shred on a board. It was the best thing in the world. I mean, like, top one, definitely one of the top five moments in my entire life. Me and my friends pretended we were the Bones Brigade when we'd go skateboarding. and. This is fun and we looked up to those guys and they kind of paved the way for the future. And for some, it was about sharing their love of skateboarding with their family. I am super stoked. Like we, we obviously got two of the signed decks, so he'll get one of them in the future when he gets older and we'll have pictures with him and Steve Cavallaro. I mean, it's awesome. In Green Bay, John Miller, NBC 26.